I was absolutely delighted to hear that I was going to be this year's winner of the prize. has this very elaborate territorial call. It's by far and away the, the most prestigious prize for conservation in the world. And when I look at the list of previous recipients, that's a pretty elite group and people who I have enormous respect for. And so just being part of that community, both the winners and the finalists, is just a, a great honor. And in many ways, it's the, the greatest honor I've ever received. Most of what you find in the forest is by sound. You first hear, and then you see. He's always kind of exemplified to me the jungle explorer character. When we traveled abroad together, he became kind of this larger-than-life character. The way Dad makes his influence on people and makes his impact is his unwavering passion and enthusiasm, and it's what makes people remember. Russell Mittermeier is regarded as a world leader in the field of biodiversity and tropical forest conservation. Initially drawn to primates, this led to studies in Brazil and an assortment of species in Madagascar. He discovered over 20 subspecies of frogs, monkeys, lemurs, and a lizard, many of which are named after him. The tropical rainforests of Suriname owe a great deal of debt to Mittermeier's tireless efforts. Through relationships with locals and government officials, Mittermeier's influence has helped to keep the rainforests in the small South American country nearly 90% intact. Mittermeier also focuses on working in the world's richest ecosystems that are also the most threatened, areas known as biodiversity hotspots. From 1989 to 2014, Mittermeier served as president of Conservation International, an organization that has contributed to the protection of more than 260 million acres of land and sea, influencing changes in policy that have protected countless species and land areas. In 2017, Mittermeier became the chief conservation officer at Global Wildlife Conservation. <laughs> Great shot. A move that ensured he can continue doing what he loves the most. Here we are in the Virungas National Park, Kopanami River at Fungal Island, Congo portion of the Virunga Volcanoes, in the Central Suriname Nature Reserve. As hard as in every country in the world, I don't think there's anybody else like that that really gets it and that's willing to just keep going and never stop. I love this stuff, I've always loved it. There's nothing like the experience of being out there and interacting with nature on a first-hand basis. You just have to be optimistic and you just have to continue pushing. <laughs>